welcome to my channel. If you're new, welcome. I do unboxings for clothing, food, um, basically just kind of uh, every stuff. Um, I also like to do a glass of wine. So today we are opening a Wannable, the Sunny Escape edit, and we are drinking some Merlot. This is from my Bright Cellars um, wine subscription box. I get them once a month in the six bottles. So let's go ahead and pour this and get started. Gotta love that sound. That's good enough for today. All right. Sip. Okay, I almost did not do this video today because it's, it's, it's been a Wednesday. Does anyone else have problems during the middle of the week just finding energy to do anything? Um, seems like Wednesday is always the hardest day. You know, that hump day, blues. But I figured that this would probably help me get in a better mood and to relax and hang out with y'all. So I have some upcoming videos. I do know that I have a new flip fit that is in the mail. It should be here tomorrow. Um, I also decided to try something new. I do need new underwear, so I did try the Splendies and the Naughty Knickers. So I'm going to do a comparison of the two when those come in. All right. <clears throat> but today, we have our Wannable. We have our Styled for Laura. All right. Let's see what this bundle looks like. Oh. Oh, it's stuck. It's stuck. It's stuck. All right. The, again, this is the... Is it the sunny, what do they got? Sunny escape at it. So it's supposed to be for spring and summer, for vacation. All right, right on top, we have our return bag to throw everything in there and to drop it that I don't want and drop it off at the post office. Um, you do get seven items in your wantable bag um, with a price list and a note from the stylist. Um, I will go over this later because I don't want to see the prices right now. Um, Wannable also gives you an option to use UPS, so that is always an option. They put that return label on the back. Uh, let me hide my address. On the back here where you can peel it off and you can send everything back in the box instead of that bag. Okay, <clears throat> let's see. On top we have this nice, um, it looks kind of cropped. I don't, I'm not a big cropped shirt kind of girl, um, mainly because I like to hide my belly. Um, but the pattern is really cute. It's really lightweight. I love the colors that are in it. it. Has some like light blue. Sorry, the lighting's a little off in the bedroom. But you see like the little light blue in there. All right. Then we have this democracy shirt. Actually requested this one. You can request on Wannable. You have like a stream. And it looks like it has little puff sleeves. And this is in a size extra large. Sorry. This one's probably also a size extra large. It is. And it is by Gentle Fawn. All right. Then we have, oh, this looks like a dress. I love the color. All right, this is a dress by Bobo, size extra large. It looks like a fake, yeah, fake wrap dress. This is pretty. This has some promise to it. Okay. We have a t-shirt by Suburban Riot. Let's see what it says. Y'all will be able to see it before me. Okay, so tequila, smoothies, kabuchi, craft brew, green juice, and iced coffee. All right, I probably won't be keeping this shirt because the only thing that I like on this shirt would be tequila and smoothies. Um, so here we go. I did request, I still haven't gotten it, um, the shirt by this brand and it is gray, um, but it has like wine across the thing and we all know that I love my wine. So I'm hoping that they find that shirt and send it to me in one of my edit boxes. Okay, next it looks like we have some shorts. These are by Democracy in a size 12. They're little cutoff shorts. Right, and they have like the elastic waistband that Democracy has. Then it looks like we have some skinny jeans by Kinsey, size 12, um, with a little distressing on them. 
And a jacket by Kinsey. It's like a utility jacket. I like the color. Um, I don't really have use for new jackets right now. Um, it's only really cool sometimes at night, but it's, it's 75 degrees and we're in a cool front right now and it's still 75 degrees. All right, so that is my box. We're gonna go ahead and try on a first outfit and I will be back. Hi there. Okay, I'm back. And the first thing we're gonna talk about are the jeans. These are the skinny jeans by Kinsey. They fit really nice. I like them. I just don't really have a need for more skinny jeans. They do have the frayed bottom. But yeah, I mean, there's nothing wrong with them at all. I just, I don't think I have a need for another pair. We'll have to see what the pricing is on them. They are really comfortable. All right, let me go ahead and move the camera and then we'll talk about the tops. And now we have the utility jacket, which is a little tight in the arms. You can see it pull a lot right here. So it just doesn't fit me well. Um, it is pretty lightweight. Let's see if it even zips. Um, a little snug. Yeah, it's not gonna zip over my boobs. Or it will probably, it's just gonna squish them down. Let's, let's, let's leave it there. So um, it just does not fit me right. All right, and then we also have the crop top. Excuse my arms, my arm fat the shirt shows. But, yeah, it's not for me. I don't like crop tops. I don't like to, I don't like shirts this short. Um, it also does not fit across the chest area correctly for me. It pulls way too much. All right. Let's have a sip and then we'll be back with the next outfit. All right, next we have the democracy top. Um, I'm not in love with it. I don't like how it's fitting right here and how it shows every little lump and bump. Um, it just doesn't, doesn't hide enough for me. I mean, it fits right, it's the right size. It's not too big, it's not too small. It's not tight on the arms. I'm just um, I'm not liking it on me and how it fits my body and um, where I'm self-conscious at, which is right in here. Other than that, yeah, it's really cute. I love the pattern. You can see the pattern here and the little puff sleeves. Those are really cute. I just wish it laid better on me. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and try on the shorts and that t-shirt and I'll be right back. These are the Democracy shorts. Um, they fit really well, I do like them. Um, the length, I don't know, it's something about the way they're cut off and the style of the cutoff that I'm not liking. Like it's just a little too neat for me, I think. I think you're either gonna have, if you're gonna have neat shorts like this, I'd rather like a rolled cuff or just a regular hem. If you're gonna have cutoffs, have cutoffs. Um, but yeah, other than that, they fit great. They're very comfortable. I'm just not liking them for me and my style. All right, then we have the t-shirt. Um, it's a t-shirt, it's a gray worded t-shirt. Um, it's comfortable, just, and Betty always, right here, pretty much always shows, especially with brand new jeans. All brand new jeans kind of poke your belly out a lot. But, um, yeah, so here it is. Nothing really special about it. It is a comfy, soft t-shirt, but the saying doesn't really apply to me, so I will not be keeping the shirt. All right, I have that dress and I'll be right back. Here is the faux wrap dress. As you can see, it goes, I mean, it does come up, so the faux wrap dress, but it is like attached over here. And it does have like a little tie here. It's like almost there. Like it wants to be cute, but it's, it's just not making it there for me. And I don't really know why. I don't know if the color is washing me out a little bit, which I normally love this color. I like the high-low. I like the little tulip in the front. 
but for some reason I just I can't I don't know if it's how it falls like right here and how it kind of shows everything like it's it's loose fitting but also clingy if that makes any sense sorry about my socks <laughs> but yeah I'm, I'm on the fence about this dress there's just something I'm not liking about it and I can't put my finger on it let me know what y'all think in the comments um, I'm just I'm not sure why I'm not liking the dress it's really cute um, it covers everything it needs to cover. Like, it, I can even bend down and it doesn't, nothing pops out. It fits well. I just, there's something about it I'm not liking. Um, and I just can't figure it out. Let me know what y'all think in the comments below. And I'll see you on the second for a go over pricing and for a wrap up. All right, well, this Wednesday just keeps getting better and better. It just started storming outside. So if you hear some rain, it's because it, I just fell out here. So let's go ahead and go over some pricing. And I'm gonna, I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep anything out of this box. I might just be eating my $20 styling fee. Um, if you're new to Wannable, it is $20 styling fee. And that $20 does go towards anything that you do keep. Um, also, if you keep at least five items, you get 20% off. All right, so the first thing on the list here is going to be that wrap dress, which I just, for some reason, I, I can't figure out why I don't like it. I, I just, nothing wrong with it. It's super cute. It's soft. The material's great. Um, it is um, Rowan Wrap Dress in Cassie Extra Large um, by Bobo, and it is $78. Okay, then we have the Democracy Shorts. These are the Absolution High Rise Short in Light Blue Vintage 12, Size 12 by Democracy, and these are $64. Um, I, I just don't, I don't know about these. I, I love the, love how they fit. I just, I don't like, I don't think I like the style. All right. Then let's see what's next on here. Oh, um, the Tequila Loose Tea. In Heather Gray, size extra large by Suburban Riot, it is $38, which is about par for this um, name brand of t-shirt. Um, they do last for a good while. It is very good material. All right, then we have the Puff Sleeve Shirt Tail Printed Tee Blue Surf in Black, size extra large by Democracy, and this is only $39. Yeah. I wish I would have liked this one better. Um, it's just something I didn't I think it was just how it fit around my arms and chest. All right, then we have the Kinsey High Rise Skinny, and these are $58, which is actually a pretty decent price for these jeans. Um, one thing I did notice while I was wearing them, this right here is really thin. So if you have like any extra, um, skin or fat or something like that it feels kind of weird and kind of scratchy right here um so that's one thing I did not like it was not the tag I thought it was the tag it's actually right here like it's it's super thin right here and you can feel all of this so that's one thing to consider with these okay. then we have the crop tank top um this is but botanical cami in green rainforest size extra large I love the print on this, it's super pretty. It just didn't fit right and I don't like, I don't like short tank tops. And this is by Gentle Fawn and it is $49. All right, last we have the utility jacket, which did not fit right. Um, this one is utility jacket in Moonlight Jade, size extra large by Kenzie and it is $68. All right, that's it. Um, I, I actually don't think I'm keeping anything. I, I think this was a complete bust for me. Um, nothing really fit right. I didn't really fall in love with anything. Um, so I, I just don't think I'm gonna keep it, everything. But let's go over the full pricing. <clears throat> so the entire box was $394. If I would've kept at least five items, I would've got $78.80 off, bringing my order to $315.20 and then the styling fee credit of $21.99 because I do charge taxes on your styling fee credit. 
um, plus the sales tax would have been a total of $324.57. Um, if you haven't tried Wonderbull before, I haven't actually had much luck. Um, I don't, I think I'm going to get a few more boxes and I'm not sure how many more I'm actually going to get from Wannable. They have not really listened to what I, my feedback and like I, for one, I definitely told them I don't like crop tops in my styling thing and they sent a crop top. Um, so I, I just, I don't know, <laughs> but, um, I'm going to try them one more time. My regular styling edit is set to come out on April 1st, so I should have another Wannable in a few weeks. And we're going to give them one more try because I've never gotten anything more than one item out of a box. My last box only kept one item just not to lose my $20. Um, and I just didn't, I didn't find anything in here that I would even remotely even wear. Um, so I'm just eating this $20. But anyway, if you like this video, hit that thumbs up button. If you want to see more, hit that subscribe button. And thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.